What's going on, Slayers? This week is week five of the Viva Las Vega event, which was kind of unnecessary, but now it's kind of weird. You can see why already. I'm Dark Shot of the YouTube Assassin. Let's get our Doom Eternal on. Okay, so there is a ton going on with these week five challenges. Normally, first of all, we don't need a, a week five. Normally, most people complete the challenges within the first two weeks. They get all the prizes. And then maybe the next week or so, you're gaining extra XP for, you know, like whatever, like the, the king thing that we have for the Mancubus where you could go from like having him look like Elvis Presley all the way to like his podium and everything like that. So, it, I mean, that's usually what happens with week two, week three. And now this is, I think, the second event that they gave us a week five. But we never had a week five like this. First of all, as you can see, there's only six challenges. And uh, I'll explain them to you. Play on, complete three missions, complete any three missions. Okay, Super Gore Nest, complete the Super Gore Nest. Now, what I've done was I played Sentinel Prime twice in a row because it's a very short level and I could achieve this very quickly. I'm saving my third mission for Super Gore Nest so I can knock these both out at once. Gladiator. Win seven battle mode matches. We've never had it where you had to win the battle mode match. That's interesting. So I'm assuming that it's the entire matches, not just the rounds. Stress Dream. Complete one mission on Nightmare or Harder. All right. That's going to be kind of wild. And oh, also, I wanted to point out Play On and Super Gornest, 30,000 XP each. Gladiator. 40,000 XP. Stress Dream, 50,000 XP. You could do this on Nightmare. It doesn't have to be Ultra Nightmare. If you do just Nightmare, that counts as a completed uh, mission. Okay, so in, in Nightmare, you could get you, you could get one-ups. So you could just do that. Enter the arena, win one match in battle mode for 30,000. Coliseum Victor, win three battle mode matches for another 30,000. So obviously if you got this one, you have one in each of these. If you get this one, you now have, you know, like uh, I, I believe it would be probably like three over here because it, it would count this way, you know? So then you would just have to win four more matches. If you have a good bunch of friends, you could boost it. Now for completing only three of these missions, you'll get an additional 50,000 XP according to the week five challenge bar. And if you complete all six, 100,000 XP. Now, that's a grand total of 360,000 XP for completing these missions. But it's even crazier than that because this is a double XP weekend. So... What does that mean? That means that for this whole weekend, you're actually going to double what you make there, which is going to be like absolutely amazing. But it starts tomorrow, not today. So you may want to hold off on completing these challenges until tomorrow. Okay, today is the 17th. The free weekend starts the 18th through the 21st. So that's going to be actually Friday all the way through Monday. So just keep that in mind. You may not want to actually start doing these until tomorrow. You may want to make that plan. So, I mean, 720,000 XP in total for doing all of this. That would be absolutely out of control. 
So anyway, I'm at the end of Super Gore Nest. Thank you for the uh, the woo there. The generator so, is now at full power. Here we are. I'm just gonna like run to the end. To destroy the heart. We'll turn the console on. The do our thing. I have marked your exit portal. And just Main like always, uh, you could do this Armor with the cheats on. You don't only have to have the cheats on. You could also do this. Uh, you, you, you don't have to like play through the game to do it. You could actually do it, you know, level by level. You could select a level. You could select a mission. Oh, good, an empowered game. It was an empowered game. So this will be the end of the Super Gore Nest. A little more gameplay. Yeah. All right. Let's take a look at the rewards. Quake no event XP. That's odd. Doom level gain. Okay, now that is actually strange. I completed Super Gore Nest. Why would it not give me that those points? And I did three in a row. Interesting. Okay, hold on. Let's take a look at the events, because that was kind of weird. Well, it shows that I, sh I completed them. That's kind of odd. Didn't give me the, the XP initially, it looks like. Well, as long as I've got it. So, anyway, that's all there is to that. Um, you know, like, for some of you, these matches are going to be easy. For some of you, it's going to be a little hard. Depending on your skill level, like I said, if you have a couple of friends that you could like boost with, then by all means do it. It'll be much easier. And then this one you could do on Nightmare. Doesn't have to be Ultra Nightmare, and you'll be able to like gain this XP here. But again, this is just kind of weird. I've never seen anything like this. I've never seen them do this. Anyway, let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Do you prefer that they not even do a week five? Do you prefer that they do this in week four? Do you think that there should be better prizes? Let me know what you think in the comments below. Other than that, I really do hope you enjoyed the video. Please like and subscribe. It helps the channel out an awful lot. And as always, I want to thank each and every one of you for watching. Until the next one, take care.